Africa's blacks, it was a long night of celebration. The flame of freedom had been lit by Nelson Mandela's victory and the streets of this country's biggest city were theirs. And on the first morning of the new South Africa, it was a tale of hopes and expectations. I think everything will be okay. Every, everybody will have work. I want uh, my mother have a job and my father have a job. We expect jobs and it's quite a lot of things that has been promising us. And delivering on those promises is President Mandela's biggest task. Many fear the influence of ANC communists like Joe Slovo, but it's likely more moderate thinkers such as Thabo Mbeki and Cyril Ramaphosa will play major roles in the new government. The stock market here is watching anxiously to see the direction of ANC economic policy. Businessmen are cautiously optimistic. Providing the ANC adopt fairly moderate economic policies, this place is going to be one of the best places in the world to be because we are the most modern economy on the African continent. The new South Africa has been born in a spirit of great hope, but after a lifetime of struggle, Nelson Mandela now faces an enormous challenge, fulfilling the expectations and dreams of a new generation of South Africans, both black and white. Mark Austin, ITN, Johannesburg.